Biography Teglalorup Teglalorup, May 9, 1973, is a Kenyan long-distance track and road runner. She was the first African woman to win the New York City Marathon and has held many world records, from 20 kilometers to the marathon. She now devotes much of her time to humanitarian and peace activities, through her Teglalorup Peace Foundation. Early Life Teglalorup Tegl Teglalorup was born in Kutamwani in the West Pocket District of Kina, situated in the Rift Valley, north of Nairobi. Tegla grew up with 24 siblings, her father had four wives. She spent her childhood working in the fields and looking after younger brothers and sisters. From an early age, Lorup was given a nickname, Kamisha. It means, the one who never gets annoyed. Reflecting her cheerful personality. At the age of seven, she started to go to school, which involved a barefoot run of 10 kilometers every morning. It was at school that her first talent for running was spotted. These early races were normally held over a distance of 800 or 1,500 meters. However, with the exception of her mother and older sister, she received little support for her dream to become a runner. At one point, her father banned her from running saying it was not ladylike. Lorup was expected to concentrate on more utilitarian tasks such as looking after her siblings. Lorup became dismayed at the obstacles placed in front of her. At one point, she even considered becoming a nun. At this point, I was so fed up with men, Ms. Lorup said, I thought of becoming a nun. NYT. However, Lorup persisted and continued her running. Ever the peacemaker, she also later made peace with her father. Although she wryly commented, of course we're friends now, she said. When you're successful, everyone wants to be your friend. He said he was sorry that he was close to destroying my career, Lorup said. I told him I was lucky that I had a strong mind, and I didn't listen to him. Initially, the Kenyan Athletics Federation were not too impressed with Lorup, she was considered too frail. However, after winning a prestigious cross-country race in 1988, this changed. She was nominated for the Junior World Championships, and at her first attempt, 1989, she finished 28th. This enabled her to focus on running full-time. In 1994, Lorup ran her first major marathon in New York and won. She was the first African woman to win the New York Marathon. As a consequence, she became an important sporting role model. Kenya, at last, had a female runner. To rank alongside its talented male athletes. After this initial success, Tegla Lorup went on to win many major marathons around the world. Between 1997 and 1999, she won three consecutive World Half Marathon Championships. In the World Championships, she won bronze in the 10.000M in both 1995 and 1999. The 2000 Summer Olympics in Sydney, Lorup was tipped to be a hot favorite. However, on the eve of the race, she suffered from food poisoning. Despite being weakened by the illness, she managed to complete both the marathon in 13th place and the 10.000M in 5th place. Lorup late stated that she started the marathon out of a sense of duty to all the people looking up to her as a role model in Kenya. Between April 19, 1998 to September 30, 2001, Lorup held the world record for the marathon. She initially set a time of 2 hours 20 minutes and 47 seconds in the 1998 Rotterdam Marathon. In 1999, she broke her own record, setting a time of 2 hours 20 minutes and 43 seconds in the Berlin Marathon. She has also held world records at 1 hour, 20, 25 and 30 kilometers. The marathon proved to be Lorup's most successful distance. She won the marathons of Rotterdam three times between 1997 and 1999, New York in 1994 and 1995, Berlin in 1999, London and Rome in 2000 and Lausanne in 2002. In 2003, Lorup found the Tegla Lorup Peace Foundation and has been an active advocate for peace. 
she has been successful in bringing members of warring tribes together. In 2006, she founded the 10 Kilometers Peace Race, which included 2,000 warriors from six different tribes. Lorup said the motivation for the race was to use her fame to help bring about greater harmony. She grew up in a pastoral environment where life was really hard because of the local conflicts between the tribes and people stealing cattle. All of this on top of conditions that were hard to start with, she said, I was lucky. I had talent and was able to make a success out of running and I felt that I wanted to give things back to the community I grew up in. Race has become an important and significant athletic event. Lorup's work in promoting peace has been praised by many. Beatrice Karanja, a regional media officer for Oxfam said. Tegla is doing brilliant work, absolutely brilliant work, she's given these warriors options. She hasn't just gone in there and told them to stop. She's given them hope for things they can do. In 2006, she was named a United Nations Ambassador of Sport. She is also a member of the Champions for Peace, a group of athletes seeking to use the power of sport to bring about peace. Lorup has also sought to advance the opportunities of Kenyan women. She is a role model and has helped many women widen their horizons and enter new fields such as running. Right now, we have a lot of women running, more than before. For me, I had to fight the Federation. Still now, I have to and I don't why. But at least now there are chances for other women. It makes me proud. That is very positive. I'm happy about that. NYT Tegla Lorup is single and has not married. She splits her time between Detmold, Germany, Kenya and traveling around the world for her various humanitarian initiatives.